Sorry, baby, show me. What is up guys, welcome back to another video. I'm gonna try to keep this one short, this is actually the second take of this, but it's that time, it's time for another channel update. Um, you're probably wondering, didn't you just do one a few months ago, uh, or a few weeks ago? I kinda did, it was on the truck, on itself, but this is like the whole shebang, this is the whole channel, RT2 included, all that stuff. So I guess we'll start off with uh, this channel. So uh, I just wanna thank you guys for getting us close to 600 subscribers. If you have any ideas for something I should do for 600 subscribers, let me know in the comments of this video. Message me on Instagram at one though 4.0 or anything you guys got, cause um, I want some ideas to do a really cool video for 600. Obviously a thousand is gonna be where it goes big and I'm gonna put out a really monster video hopefully. Um, but for 600, I want to do something cool as well. So if you guys have any awesome ideas, let me know in the comments below that I can really do um, a really nice job on for 600 subscribers. So thank you guys again for getting us close to that. Um, live streams, we do have plans to do a live stream sometime this week of our own spin on that Dude and Blues car tier list video, um, which I love that video. It was such a good video and it was like really insightful to see like how David's tastes actually are. Um, so we're gonna try to do our own spin on that for like myself and Hayden. We did we did meet a couple. We did meet a cool guy uh, over at a party over the weekend. We're trying to maybe get him involved in this too, um, as well as Brandon. We haven't had Brandon on the videos in a while uh, with the Integra. So we're gonna try to get him in there too. Uh, we're gonna try to get the squad together sometime this week. Um, the, well, the the four of us now, uh, and try to uh, go to some meets. Um, probably Friday. Probably might go to Boosted Friday as long as the weather holds up. Um, Saturday, there's a car show going on pretty close to home. Um, but the goal is to try to get the headers installed by then. So if you guys watched the, I believe the last video, I don't know if the Cafe and Oxy video came out first and the, the last video, which was taking care of the small things in the truck. Um, I put on screen briefly that we're taking the truck to get a shot, go to the shop to get the headers installed. So we were originally planning on doing them at home, but my dad um, decided he didn't want to because he's afraid of fit and finish on the truck because Pretty much the headers are not true sport track headers, they are Ranger headers. Um, theoretically, they should work perfectly okay because, well, for one thing, the trucks have similar engine bays and similar engine configurations. Um, but my dad obviously is concerned. So we're gonna take it to Beast Garage, the same guys that put the Flowmaster on a couple years back and did the uh, crank sensor fix when my truck broke down after getting it back from the trans shop. Um, they've been awesome. They do fantastic work. Um, we're gonna do a mid cat delete as well. So we're gonna have the two main cats on the headers, but the mid cats are gone. We'll, have, we'll probably keep the resonator on just to, just to tone down rasp. And I don't want it to be obnoxiously loud. I want it to be noisy, but not to the point where I'm like, please stop, shoot me, like get rid of this. You know, I want it to be, you know, not terribly loud. So that's kind of the goal. Um, I plan on eventually swapping out for a cherry bomb that way or swapping the resonator for a cherry bomb that way I can still tone down rasp but it'd be a little bit louder um, but rasp for right now I plan on just keeping the stock resonator on and you know I can do the resin the cherry bomb myself eventually um, so yeah headers installed coming soon uh, hopefully the next couple of weeks we can have it done uh, we're just waiting to hear back on a quote from the guy and we're gonna try to see uh, a perfect timeline to take it in because my dad wants to leave it while we go down to Florida in a few weeks um, meanwhile, I want to get it done ASAP, so we'll see how it goes. But uh, yeah, that's the header install update. I'm holding off my next mod until the truck gets its headers on, or get the quote at least, because I want to know what I'm getting myself into before then. Uh, with that, so um, yeah, that's the that's the headers install in a nutshell. So we're hoping to get that done here very very soon, and um, it won't be too much longer, and we can be loud again, or louder, loud in general. So, um, we're going to be doing a video on the S2000 this week, uh, Hayden's car. Uh, a lot of you guys who have been subscribed for a while know Hayden's car. It's been gone for a couple months now. Um, I know some of you guys are going to be really excited to see the car back, especially uh, AP2 Kyle, who, uh, who's been subscribed for a while. Um, and even found Hayden on Instagram and talked to him and all stuff, which is really cool. I love hearing those kinds of stories where the subscribers like talk to either me or him or anyone that's been involved in the videos. Um... So yeah, we're going to try to shoot a video this week with the car and kind of just give you guys an update on where it's been, what's been going on with it, because Hayden's getting some money rolling and he's going to start modding it again soon. So it's going to be awesome to see the car finally take his image. And uh, I really can't wait to share that with you guys. So sometime this week we're going to shoot it. I don't know if it's going to be a Wednesday upload or a Saturday or a Wednesday upload or a Friday upload. We're going to try to shoot for Wednesday, hopefully. Um, but as it sits right now, um, the car hasn't changed too much. 
<laughs> uh, it's got a couple. It's got a, like a couple new things. Nothing too crazy. So be ex I hope y'all are excited for that because it's been a long time coming for the S two thousand to return. Um, so the Kia, I guess, since that's like the third project car for the channel, um, the Kia we are working on. Uh, well, I say we. I mean, my dad, and my brother are working on putting uh, underglow in the car. It had underglow when my dad had it um, for a little while, and Liam wanted to kind of bring that back into the car. So they got started on it today. Put a couple pieces on. It's not finished by any means, um, but they should be finished hopefully in the next week or two. It's gonna be awesome. I can't wait to see it finished. Um, it's been a little over 12 years since the car had underglow, so it's gonna be really cool to see. Um, car reviews, I guess. I haven't brought up car reviews in a while. We don't, we've only done, we haven't done any this year. Um, I haven't really decided if I want to continue the car reviews because of the style of them. They're, I mean, they're passenger seat reviews. It's not like I'm not actually ripping the car and, and getting a feel for it like someone like that dude in blue. The style's very similar to that dude in blue. I kind of don't want to step on his toes. I, I did a lot of things very similar to him for the longest time, which included the car reviews. Um, and all that. So I'm trying not to step on his toes and kind of just create my own kind of style. So uh, I don't know how much longer car reviews are going to be going on. So um, I guess if you guys want to see me do car reviews again, let me know. Because right now it's, uh, I, I honestly don't think I want to continue them. But if you guys want to see them, I'll continue them. So let me know. Um, I guess events. I do have some ideas for some events. I mean, Hayden had briefly mentioned going to Grid Life this year. So we might do that. Um, street car takeover. I really want to at least attend this year. Uh, I do want to race. I want to get in on a test on tonight and just race the truck like street car, uh, street car takeover. So we might try to make that happen. But as it sits right now, I don't know exactly what the plan is for the truck to race this year. My goal is to have it on a drag strip at least once by the end of the year. That's kind of my goal. So we'll see how that goes. We'll see if we can actually make it happen. Um, RT2, I just uploaded the video on that side for the Mac Pro unboxing, which I've, I've had the Mac for a little over a month now. It's awesome. Uh, I have no really problems to report really minus like a couple hiccups um so if you guys haven't seen that video and want to go see it go check it out um and it's in the uh, the channels in the description and the uh it's also in the featured channels list on the side of the channel i'm apologizing how much i'm pausing right now my throat's like really hurting for some reason so i'm trying to like keep it down as much as i can so i can not hurt myself um yeah i think that's pretty much everything i wanted to cover um Hopefully in the next little while we'll have more mods for the truck. I'm trying to be very financially responsible, so I'm not buying a crap ton of mods for the truck right now. I have a you know a little bit of money and savings. Uh, I'm trying to spend as little as possible until I can get the engine built. So we'll see how that goes. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, be sure to like and subscribe for more because we're gonna have a lot of cool videos coming very soon. Uh, like I said, the S2000 is returning this week, so hope you guys are really excited for that because I know you guys love that car. We'll hopefully have Brandon and the new guy in the videos here soon. Um, but yeah, hope you guys enjoy. I'll see you guys next time.